Did Noah Beck finally confirm his relationship with Dixie D'Amelio? We'll tell you what he said and not just talk about his phone background. I'm Kelsey Vanis and you're watching The Daily Report. Ooh, Doa is here to stay. Very exciting news, guys. Dixie D'Amelio and Noah Beck have been friends for a while. I mean, Dixie has known most of the guys in the Sway House for a bit since she was previously dating Sway House member Griffin Johnson. Those two started dating earlier this year before calling it quits after some cheating rumors at the end of July. I mean, it wasn't only the cheating rumors Dixie did defend Griffin when those popped up at the beginning of July, but clearly some stuff happened behind the scenes that made them decide to ultimately pull the plug. It seemed like a fairly amicable breakup. The two made a plea to fans to not show hate to each other. And that was that. Hearts were left to heal, and for a couple of weeks, we didn't hear much else. That is, until Dixie started hanging out with Noah Beck. The two began to appear in TikToks more and more, and then on August 20th, the premiere of the Dixie D'Amelio show, Dixie's sister Charlie called her out asking, quote, what do you and Noah do when you guys hang out? This sent Dixie into a giggling fit that ended with her saying, quote, he's cool. A day later, Noah had a similar reaction when asked about Dixie by the paparazzi. He smiled uncontrollably and said, quote, no comment. <laughs> you better believe the hashtag Doa ship was getting ready to set sail at that point. Cruising, just chilling on, you know, chilling in the middle of the ocean. Everything's good with Doa. A week and a half later, the two filmed the music video for Dixie's Be Happy remix, and although it wasn't released until two weeks ago, now that we know that they had to make out for the video, the footage from them at the restaurant that night makes much more sense. <laughs> I mean, there was a point where she wrapped her hand around his neck and got in real close. Like, we thought that they were gonna kiss close, and apparently they had been earlier that day. Although, just for the camera. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Can you do it at the same time? That was bad. <laughs> well, that's what they'd like you to believe because immediately after the paparazzi attained that footage, the two left the restaurant where Dixie reassured everyone that they are BFFs, just friends, just besties. I've heard it all. We've seen them at the beach together, taking pictures at parties together, and even out at dinner together. And though they continue to deny any relationship, calling each other quote unquote besties, it seems that Noah was all in on making this relationship public when he appeared on the Dixie D'Amelio show last week. The video started out innocent enough with Dixie asking Noah if he contours his abs. Is that a thing now? <laughs> But the tables were quickly turned on Dixie when Noah became the host and asked her questions like to describe her dream boy, why she picked him to kiss her in her music video. I mean, he basically asked where the relationship was going at one point. All of the signs pointing towards dating. <laughs> Noah also sent hashtag Doa fans into a fit when he revealed that the two had kissed before the music video. And while Dixie tried to cover, calling them quote, warm up kisses, for the video, Noah confessed, quote, and we had some cool down ones after, right? Noah coming in hot. Noah wants it to be public. At the end of the video, Noah asked Dixie how many kids she wanted and, um, hello, planning for the future like that already? Most people would see this video and be like, okay, yeah, they are for sure dating. I mean, the guy has a picture of him and Dixie kissing during the video shoot for Be Happy on his phone background. Mm-hmm, you heard me right. At least that is what the TikTok Room Instagram page is claiming. It's honestly really hard to make out in the photo because all of his apps are on there, but we finally got a real, they actually said it, it's definitely happening confirmation from Noah today. Uh, chills. <laughs> in a video called Internet's Most Search Questions with Noah Beck, right on Awesomeness TV's YouTube channel, one of the questions that of course came up is, quote, who was Noah Beck dating? And Noah didn't dance around it. He didn't avoid it. He just straight up said, quote, I am dating Dixie D'Amelio. It is happening, guys. <laughs> but wait, there's more. He added, quote, Dixie's amazing. She's an awesome girl. It's been really fun. And so I'm excited for the future with her. And let me tell you, the dude could not stop smiling. He's in love. Well, I don't know if they said the L word. Don't quote me, but they're really cute together. <laughs> Noah even commented on the clip posted on the TikTok room where he confirmed the relationship, writing a simple quote first. And when one fan asked him last night on TikTok, quote, aren't you the guy who's dating Dixie? He wrote back, quote, yeah, with a little heart face emoji. And fans are definitely on board tweeting things like, quote, Noah Beck saying he's dating Dixie D'Amelio is making me craze AF. 
Some were even surprised, writing, quote, Noah Beck is dating Dixie and Emilio. Totally surprised. Ha <laughs> We already knew that, Noah. Winky face. <laughs> Okay, maybe they aren't that surprised. <laughs> but now we want to know what you think. Are you glad that this is finally out in the open and we can all officially ship hashtag Doa together? Let us know down in the comments below. And as always, don't forget to subscribe to the Awesomeness TV Daily Report channel. And make sure to check us out at Awesomeness TV on Instagram for more. I'm Kelsey Sabanis and... Am I the only one freaking out about this? It's about time! I called it! So happy.